An Ontario record store chain is betting on vinyl as it embarks on a major expansion. Sunrise Records is taking over 70 stores that are being vacated by HMB Canada. Sunrise says it plans to replace vinyl records in the front windows, sell board games, and even feature cassette tapes for more nostalgic customers. The stores may be open by spring. Sunrise Records president Doug Hutman is joining me now in studio. Really? <laughs> yes. Is it really. 1986 <laughs> all over again? Yeah. <laughs> What's the thinking behind this? And this is a big enterprise, 70 stores. For sure, for sure. You know, uh, we, we bought the chain several years ago, and uh, when we heard the news, obviously it was quite shocking that HMB was uh, was going to depart the marketplace. And uh, it was a, it's a now or never. Um, do we jump on this and get the stores open right away? Uh, or do we stick with the, the stores that we have? And uh, overwhelmingly, uh, everybody uh, that I spoke to wanted to, to go forward with it. And uh, I'm excited. So what is it that makes you think that you can succeed where HMV could not? Yeah, I think that's a great question. One I get asked a lot right now. Um, I think, you know, changing the assortment a little bit. I think we know vinyl is growing rapidly. Um, so more features on vinyl. I think more stock in the stores, uh, more diverse stock. Um, a lot of apparel, uh, trend and pop culture merchandise. I think those are the things that are going to really uh, differentiate us. I'm starting to second guess selling my Walkman. That's good. Bring in it that in. garage sale in 1990. <laughs> How do you see vinyl playing a role in the future of music? And why do people like vinyl? Yeah, I think, you know, there's a there's a couple things. I think vinyl is going to be a, a big thing. I mean, you hear people talking, it's a fad, it's a fad. Um, but what we're seeing is more people are coming to it. Uh, more people like it. It's something that, that that's tangible, that they can hold, they can look through. And I think everybody wants to be that much closer to uh, people they idolize, people they love and listen to. Um, so I think vinyl is going to be a, a huge piece of our business uh, over the next three to five years. Are records still being made then? They are, so uh, definitely. We've, you know, everybody's producing new records now. There's a new plant opening in Burlington, uh, Ontario. Um, so yeah, not only are there used, there's, uh, there's a lot of new out there, which is great. And who's the audience? Who do you picture going into these these stores. Yeah, I think it's it's a really diverse offering. So certainly you get uh, what everybody terms the hipster uh, coming in, a, a younger demographic. But millennials. You know, yeah, yes, that's the craziest thing. Um, you know, I was just uh, standing at one of our stores on Saturday, and and the amount of millennials that are in there buying CD, buying vinyl, I think it's going to shock everybody. I think there is a movement to go back to physical, as much as digital and, and streaming is fantastic and it serves its purpose. Everybody likes to collect something and have something tangible. And read the lyrics. Remember when you could read the lyrics to the songs 100%, on the back? Hundred <laughs> percent. Or that was that insert inside. Definitely. Okay. Definitely. Well, so, what's your goal then? You know, look, our goal is to get the chain uh, to be profitable in in the next year. Um, we know, obviously, there were a lot of statistics quoted on on uh, what HMB was losing. Uh, our goal is to get as many of the great people uh, hired for Sunrise that uh, were previously with HMV. And really, it's to promote the physical business, whether it's an independent, whether it's Sunrise. We just want people to come out and support the music business, the entertainment business, see what your, your local shops have to offer, because I think it's something very different than just buying something online. I think there's a great experience to be had, not only in our stores, but in, in all the independent record stores. Well, it, uh, it Sounds really exciting. Come back and see us yes. again and let us know how it works out for you, Doug Putnam. Perfect. Thank you very much. for your time.